Alex Adelada, New York State welterweight, super right, welterweight champion. Frank Nieves from Philadelphia. A great fight by Frank Nieves. Oh, introducing in the blue corner, trained by Daryl Lee and managed by Mario Cruz. From the combatant school in Pennsylvania, weighing in at 160 pounds. Welcome, please, Rick the Scorpion Wilson. <laughs> and coming out of him, out of the red corner, he is trained by Sensei Tony Arno and Sensei Fred Coratone. He weighed in at 160 pounds. With a record of 14 wins and only one loss, he is known as the Sandman. Welcome, please, Mike Sexton. Oh yeah. <laughs> Thanks, fellas. Um, and you can hear all of Mike's friends in the background. Oh, yeah, a very popular fighter, a very thorough fighter. All right. Uh, George I'll, Strickland. I'll hazard a guess to say that Mr. George Rick Strickland Wilson. George Strickland III with John Burke the first. <laughs> We're here <laughs> at Lamero in Ocean Parkway in Brooklyn, New York for kickboxing. Well, Former I'm world champion Louis Neglia is bringing us tonight's first pro middleweight bout between Mike the Sandman Sexton and Rick the Scorpion Wilson out of Pennsylvania. And well, we I can have... tell you this much, John. Rick Wilson, he's he going to have to be sure. He him. got his work cut out and for he him. He got four rounds. Four rounds to dance with the Sandman. That roundhouse already got him dizzy. The roundhouse at the back of the head. Well, Wilson's trying to get in. Sexton is just waiting on him. He's just waiting to throw his shots. Something's going wrong here. The referee, Gargulio, is having a, a question of ethic with uh, Mike Sexton's opponent. Well, I've never seen that before. Something happened when he went down in the first part of the first round. Something occurred there. And I don't know exactly what happened. Uh, well, he caught a big roundhouse on the back of the head. And he went wild after that. And he, they, they're throwing some leather in there. He seems mad. I don't understand what exactly, other than that he's in a fight he's angry at. Well, anger can be your worst enemy in, a, in the ring. If it's not directed with force and accuracy. It'll burn your energy out. It'll make you think things Rick, that you shouldn't Rick, be thinking. Rick Wilson in the white pants with the blue gloves against Mike Sexton in the black pants with the red gloves. A good old overhand right has him quite dizzy. I said he wasn't ready. Well, needless to say, he said it at the same time. Controversy. One forty three. Uh oh, Professor Powers. Professor Powers is coming into the ring. He's extremely upset. He's extremely upset. Mike the Sandman Sexton. George 
Coach, we're still waiting to see what happens. Well, you're supposed to do your talking in the ring. Oh, oh, he says there's something in Mike Sexton's glove. That is what, <laughs> that is what Rick Wilson says that it yeah, is. It's so hard. He's that got in something in there. <laughs> Only thing in there was a hard fist. Please, George. We, we're, we're trying. No, it's just that he hits really hard. Now we know how to punch. Maybe he thought he was using a force or something. We look inside the glove. Well, I would assume he's, he hasn't been hit that hard before, so I guess he must have thought something was wrong. George, I may have to hit you if you don't stop. Well, in this, in, in this, in this particular instance, I think that we have a um, bad situation. <laughs> Did that come out of there? Was, was that in the glove? Hey, Mike, Mike. I thought I had a club hey, in my hand. You hit him so hard. I said, there's some hair gloves, so I made him fall. You hit him so hard, man. I didn't even hit him. I said, I did it to my brother. Ladies and gentlemen, the next event is a middleweight bout.